All right, guys. It's Subtickle with Subtickle Gaming, and we're playing The Walking Dead, Michonne, a Telltale Games miniseries. And we're going to be trolling. Like, we're doing every reckless possible choice I left that you so can say. people that I loved. If you haven't oh. seen my original playthrough, main playthrough, maybe you should go watch that. Unless you just want to enjoy the shenanigans first off. So, uh, let's get ready. I'm ready. Are you ready? So many, I'm serious. I can hardly remember them all. In this in this playthrough, we don't care about nobody. There could be Lee Everett, and but there are two. We'll Just we'll have an option two. to can never kill forget. him or punch him in the face. I'm just saying, be prepared for anything, because I don't care. I don't care this playthrough, guys. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe. I thought I was done with them. But they're not done with me. Huh. I'm not done with this episode. About to go into Narnia twice, twice. If y'all, if y'all don't know what I'm talking about, just Google Oprah twice or YouTube Oprah twice. Reptar, Voltron, and Mr. Teddy from Drawn to Death, whatever that bear's name is. Uh, you know, it would have been much more interesting if they just went Fruit Ninja with this game, you know? Instead of hitting up, you know, W for up, how come you just couldn't swipe with the mouse? Fights in a watermelon. Watch. Get ready to hit E. Yeah, they hit me that time. Reptar. Oh, God. Zombie. Oh, I forgot. It's not zombie. Walker. Rotisserie Walker. The cooking over here. Cooking you. Get my sword back. <laughs> that was a nice move. Well, they sound like, uh, get flashbacks of, uh, H1Z1 and the zombie noises. Excuse me, walker noises. Well, there's zombies in H1Z1. Cut me brain. Yeah. 
Yeah. I was like, there's no way that thing's getting back up if I don't <laughs> do that. Just about to begin with this. And for my uh, my first choice of options. And we know what's gonna happen. It's gonna not be the same round. Then again, they probably could have programmed it Some days for I a rare occurrence to happen. Why even bother? Okay. Alright. If you're wondering why the audio is muted, it's because there's a song in there and I don't want to deal with all that dumb stuff. So, um, yeah. So we're just going to wait till this skips and we are good to go. It will be enabled again. The Walking Dead was shown. I wonder if they would consider doing other characters after they're done with their version because they got to continue their version unless they want to like keep uh, practicing their craft or something until they get it right because season two wasn't as good as season one as I was telling y'all before. So there's that to consider. But yeah, man, like, oh, David Jap streaming right now? Lee Lee, oh yeah, that's my other video. Yeah, I'm going to be having like a couple of different, um, different versions of this, uh, this episode. So don't forget to subscribe, guys, so you don't miss it. I'm getting notifications left and right. So if you're wondering, I keep looking at my watching stuff Mama, where are you? awesome <gasps> Chesapeake Bay fuck can't sleep anymore. Rashid, come in. Over. Vanessa, you there? God damn it. Hey, Pete. I'm gonna be an a-hole to everybody. <laughs> what are you doing here? What are you, I just got up. I've like, been sleeping for like I'm seven sick. hours. Having those nightmares again. You holding up okay? Don't worry about you. You're not the easiest to read. It's hard to tell how you're really doing. Well, I'm not great. Hang in there. This stuff you're dealing with, it's not gonna go away overnight. Just please tell me if, you know, if it gets as bad as it did. I just need to keep busy. Get down here. Michonne's taking your ship. Two minutes! I still haven't heard from Rashid or Vanessa. It's not like those guys to be in a contact for this long. We trade every time I come through. Same spot. Everything's just... gone. It just doesn't make sense. Their boat is always anchored right on the dock. Vanessa! Rashid! They're dead, man. Something might have happened to them, Pete. Maybe they just... Didn't make it. Better remember that. And maybe they're still out there. Maybe oh, they dude, need our help. I gotta remember. We they didn't just say don't it. No, that's the problem. Maybe we can pass by again on our way back. Listen. 
I did hear it. You hear it? You hear it, right? Sounds like a woman's voice. I actually did. Vanessa, that you? Before, I thought it was just dead. I don't hear anything, Pete. She's there. I just gotta find the right frequency. Pete. Michonne. Ah, Lady. Again with the shortwave? I'm not just giving up. This bay was full of boats just a year ago. They went somewhere. If they left, it was probably for good reason. Then I want to know why. The reason. <sighs> the reason. Hello? Hello? The reason. Can you hear me? Hello? You heard it that time, right? She said help. I don't know, Pete. Didn't sound like Vanessa. But it's someone. She might know what happened here. No, damn it! We're losing the signal. Look. If we don't start caring about the people that are out there, we're no better than the damn walkers. All we'll find out there is trouble, Pete. I mean it. What's the point in just surviving? We gotta do better than that. Not everyone deserves saving. And what if I felt that way back when I met you? Same thing. You should understand why I'm doing this. None of the others do. Not Birdo, not Sadiq. Especially not fucking Oak. But you, you know there are people worth saving. Take over from me, okay? I'm gonna turn the boat around. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what he's talking about. Fool's crazy. What's this? Power button, turn off radio. No, yeah, just turn off the radio. Anything? I heard her. Barely. I knew it. Oh, this is a bad idea, Pete. You want to find more people. You're forgetting what people are like. What is she doing? Oh, shit! What the f Oh, bloody hell! Who's that? Can't see a damn thing! Everyone okay? Berto! Sadiq! You guys better get up here! What do we hit? Hell if I know! I can't see a damn thing! Berto, hold the wheel steady. Take in those sails, now! <laughs> Sadiq, get down! Are you all right? Thanks for the save. Jesus! I thought it would've hit oh, me. Get the jib under control! That damn short wave. You just had to take us in close, right into a fucking rock. Hey, I've been sailing these waters for years. There aren't any rocks here. Well, then what the hell was that? Something else. You said it yourself. Something's going on around here. This place isn't safe anymore, Pete. Your friends are gone, and whatever scared them off is going to find us next. I told you this was a bad idea. You're just being paranoid. It's not paranoia if you're right. We're stuck out here, nowhere to go. We shouldn't have been wasting our time out here. You all need to calm down. We don't know anything yet. She's right. Panicking about it won't make us any less stuck. That girl on the shortwave. What if she's part of it? Guys, pull it together. Oak, Sadiq, get those sails tied down. Once we've checked for damage, we can haul off. Ease our way out. Go on. Show him. What exactly did she say? I didn't hear a damn thing. It was all static. Michonne, take these. <laughs> see if you can figure out what we got stuck on. Just see if we're close to anything. I mean, I need to know what our options are. We just need to get ourselves moving again. For all our sakes. All right. Use the binoculars. Not on this side. Let's talk to you. Yeah, you. Uh... Okay. Um... Look at. Hey, Michonne. We could use a hand here. 
Yeah, fine. Maybe we gotta bleed the wind out of this sail. I stand by what I said. Pete isn't cautious enough. Look, he's just an optimist. You call it what you like, but we shouldn't be trying to find people. We should be staying the hell away from them. Look where we are. You think this is an accident? Damn wind. Grab it. Grab it! You ever stop complaining, Oak? Yeah. Yeah, I might. If you and Pete didn't give me so damn much to complain about. <laughs> oh, you think you got it all figured out, don't you? I do. <laughs> Thanks. But we can pick it up here. Because I already played the game. Let's use the binoculars and take a look at the... These things are ancient. No wonder they broke. Use the flashlight. That's all we gotta do. Whatever we ran into, put a goddamn number on the boat. Damn. All right, flashlight here. It's, uh... There it is. Hey, Pete. Yeah, I, I see it. <laughs> Figured out what we're stuck on. Damn. At least it's not Rashid's boat. Hey, Michelle. Hope no one's still on that boat. I don't want to die like that. Sorry. I just seen a lot of bad shit go down. I just... I don't want to see this fall apart, you know? Yeah, I know. I've seen better places than this get torn to shreds. I like it here. You have no idea how bad it can get out there. Right. You've seen the worst of it. The rest of us are just living cushy fucking lives like we haven't been through hell to get here. Why do I even talk to you? Whoa. <laughs> okay, we need to talk to this dude. <clears throat> Let's fix this mess. Get going again. Well, seems pretty quiet. Not much to see out there. All right, Pete. Time to go. <clears throat> Never had a tiller break like this. Pretty sure it's not under warranty anymore. Oh yeah, I didn't I didn't look at the boat. <laughs> uh where was it? See anything out there? Looks like an old ferry. Could be worth checking out. You know, extra parts, maybe some food. Maybe. All right, Pete. Time to go. <clears throat> Find anything? <laughs> Saw a ferry. Maroon near the shore. A ferry? Didn't see a ferry last time I was here. That's because we're in the Bermuda Triangle. Tiller lever shot. It snapped in two. The what? Tiller lever. Connects the wheel to the. Look, I don't know shit about boats. Just tell me what you need. 
Might have what we need to fix this damn thing. It's the best option we got. Look, I just want to get out of here. Whatever helps you do that, I'm on board. Rashid would be able to help us if we can find him. It's worth a shot. Let's round up the crew. Michonne and I will scout the ferry, see what we can find. Yo, is that right. an Applejack? So we're just gonna sit around waiting for you. You wish. You've got work to do. You didn't answer my question, though. Oh, Christ, here we go again. Guys, you three, catch the boat, pull her out of here, and lay anchor near the shoreline. Got it. Don't go anywhere. Stay near the boat and keep her safe. More like me keep you guys safe. Because I'm a boss. Don't let this turn into a rescue mission. Forget his friends, right? Best get the parts and get back here. Pete means well, but you know what they say about good intentions. All right, you trying to order me around? No, that's not what I meant. We can't lose anyone else. Know your place, Oak. I can handle myself. Come on, let's get going. Ready? Did I hear a gunshot over there? I don't think that was the sail. I heard like a gunshot in the distance, I think, before we heard the the um, sail flapping in the wind. Just heard something. Sure is quiet out here, huh? Not a sound. Kind of peaceful in a way. Don't you think? It would be, if you weren't talking so damn much. Ouch. I <laughs> can't tell if you're joking. You know, something's really been bothering me, and I have to ask. What? Do you think this looks dumb? Oh, what? I don't know. Oak's been giving me shit about it. Says I look like a pirate. What do you think? Be honest. I want to know. Jesus, is it that bad? So much for that. <sighs> You had to get you to loosen up sooner or later. You're what? always so serious. That was not the plan. It's gotta be exhausting. I'm sure you have your reasons. Just makes it hard to get to know people. <sighs> you know, when we first brought you on board, never thought you'd decide to stick around. You didn't talk to anybody. I just assumed you'd take off the minute you got your strength back. I keep expecting to wake up and find this dinghy gone, and you with it. But here you are. Haven't got sick of me yet. I'm not staying here forever, Pete. No one's gonna keep you here if you don't want to be here. When we met, you were... I mean, I saw what you were about to do. You haven't had it easy out there. I know you mostly keep it to yourself. I don't want to make you talk about it. Not unless you want to. Why'd you stop me? You pulled the gun out of my hand. If you hadn't shown up, I figured I owed you. You know, before this, I was just on my own, like you were. I convinced myself I liked it that way. But after a while, I just...
guess the war is kind of therapeutic. Yeah. One dude, you see him with the hat and the, and the gray hair from the um, from the original place when we first started out. How did he get all the way over here? <laughs> it was almost us. Guess I should have kept my mouth shut, huh? I can't believe it. Jesus. <laughs> Something funny, Pete? Huh? Why the hell are you laughing? I am? I guess I just laugh when I'm scared shitless. Be someone who can tell us where everyone went. There's no sign of anyone. Just those fucking crows. They're probably all dead, Pete. You always expect the worst, don't you? Well, unless we can find another boat, looks like we're stuck here. Looks abandoned. Doesn't mean it is, though. We'll figure something out. Glad you're feeling so optimistic. Looks like there's two ways in. The ladder or the window. To the window. Actually, we're gonna pause it right here, guys, and we're gonna pick up in the next video. So, I will see y'all in some more trolling shenanigans.